Now, your storm track weather with Chief Meteorologist Matt Miller. Today, temperatures topped out into the upper 60s and low 70s. Had a really pretty day before that cloud cover started to move in. We have rain likely for the southern half of the area tonight. The northern half of the area, rain is unlikely as it'll really just be clipping through the southern counties and then clearing out as we head into the daytime tomorrow. Mild, but a little bit windy for the middle portion of the week. And then some cooler weather and also some late week rainfall starts to move in. Here's a look statewide. Notice south of I-70, you've got to go a pretty considerable distance. This is just ground clutter uh, near the Topeka radar site. But down to the south and southwest, that's where the bulk of the rain has been during the day today. It's throwing a lot of cloud cover our way, and you can see that Manhattan mostly cloudy. Emporia now mainly cloudy, but no rain coming down. Topeka has turned cloudy as well. And the current air temperature is still very mild at 68 degrees. Southeasterly breeze is 13 miles per hour. The air beneath the clouds is quite dry as well with a dew point of 36. So any rain that even tries to develop may take quite a while before it can actually make its way through the atmosphere and actually reach the ground. So that's another factor to take into consideration. We warmed all the way to 70. Above the average high of 62, no record or anything of that sort today, but just a really pleasant afternoon. Even starting in the 30s, we made it to a high of 70. It is still 70 at Marysville, Hiawatha, Manhattan, Clay Center and Junction City, some middle 60s to the south and southeast, and the breeze coming in from the southeast, 9 to as strong as about 20 miles per hour. Those breezes will continue to weaken as the sun gets lower and eventually sets. It should come down to about 5 or 10 miles per hour and gradually become almost calm to light and variable. So the direction is almost uh, hard to even pick up on it. That very light, less than 5 mile per hour wind speed and then heading in the morning tomorrow, generally staying light and variable through a good portion of the day. Now here's a look at the rain to our northwest to our southwest, but as this creeps into our area, the system doesn't look to hold together really well. It's a fast moving system that is kind of clipping through the area. I think the best chance for rain is going to be with this batch that's over Wichita, lifting northward into the area during the evening. Could see maybe a few light rain showers farther north. But that starts to push away to the south and east. And by late in the day tomorrow, we're back in the clear. So we actually will turn sunny by tomorrow afternoon. Clear as we head into Wednesday and mostly sunny through the day Wednesday as well. Tonight we drop to 46. Showers will be limited to mainly the southern half of the area and a low temperature of 46. So the good news on one side, we're, we're kind of doing okay on rain and it does not look like we pick up much out of this after all. It is really starting uh, to show decreasing rain chances and a high tomorrow of 62. That rain in the morning sprinkles and light rain showers in wee hours of the morning and then becoming sunny. Then sunny again, but a little bit breezy on Wednesday with a high of 70. Our next system comes in late Wednesday, excuse me, late Thursday into Friday with a chance for a few showers. But this one will also bring in a little bit stronger of a cold front and drop high temperatures into the 50s for Friday and Saturday before warming back up slowly through the course of the weekend on into early next week with highs in the 60s to low 70s. Beautiful sky yesterday from Tom Kaminsky taken in Leavenworth County. There's a view of the evening sky yesterday in Manhattan as well as the sunrise this morning in Melvern. So a, a beautiful start to the day turned out to be a gorgeous day. Yeah. I just had a little bit of that cloud cover rolling in late, but I think we're going to actually enjoy a pretty good evening as the rain chance looks to be limited and late. Yeah, we like to hear that. It was nice to wake up to a beautiful morning. That's yeah, for sure. Nice start to the day and, and, and even still this evening is pretty good. Yeah, that's great.